Here's an email from a customer in Wisconsin who writes, Thanks so much for recommending your Super Solvy to solve the problem I was having with polar fleece I was embroidering. She says, It worked like a charm. We recommend Super Solvy for heavier fabrics. Can you tell us why that's better than the regular Solvy on polar fleece? I sure can, Susan, because it's one of my favorite embroidery products. I like the Super Solvy because in certain situations and with certain fabrics, it does give better support as a topping. You know, we always use a topping on textured fabrics sure. because that keeps that pile from creeping up through our embroidery threads and gives a cleaner appearance to the embroidery. Well, it, when we use a topping, we're also giving ourselves a smoother embroidery surface. So for that reason, regular Solvy works really well for most things like towels and terry cloth and those sorts of things. But on the low density of certain pile fabrics sure. like polar fleece means that the Regular weight Solvy can break down too easily by the penetration of the needle because it isn't properly supported by the fabric. So I like mid-weight Solvy, the Super Solvy, as a great alternative. We get the question whether you hoop Solvy or don't hoop Solvy. Can you explain a little bit more about that? Sure. You can hoop it in or you can hold it in place with a perimeter basting stitch. Some people even moisten their finger oh. and uh, apply a little moisture there to dissolve it onto the fabric. Or some people just lay it right on top of the fabric. But because I run multi-head machines, I like to hoop it in because then I know it won't get folded over on itself and get part of the fabric uncovered. Mm -hmm. So you can use whatever method you're comfortable with, but, and the Solvy will still do its job. I know the removal of Solvy works best by dampening it. Are there any special tricks that you know for removing Solvy? Well, yes. Actually, on fleece or any fabric that's compatible with fabric softener, I like to mix a solution of one part fabric softener to 12 parts of water in a spray bottle. And that will actually dissolve the Solvy more readily than water alone. Of course, you pull away the larger right. pieces and then just spray where the small bits are left in the small openings. And you know, the fabric softener works because if you remember ever having to pull down wallpaper. I've done that trick. And we use softener. the fabric softener. So it just eats that Solvy away more readily than water alone. Right. You can also spray the oppression left by the hoop with that same solution and the fleece will bounce right back. Another nice side benefit of using the fabric softener to remove your Solvy right. is that when you pull it out of a bag or a box, it gives you that nice fresh scent from the fabric softener. That's a great tip for everybody. <laughs> so for more great tips on using Solvy and the other types of Solvy, visit the Solvy page at ganol.com.